The love bug is a species of March fly found in parts of Central America and the southeastern United States, especially along the Gulf Coast. It is also known as the honeymoon fly or double-headed bug. During and after mating, mature pairs remain together even in flight for up to several days. The love bug is a fly that is easily identified by its black, slender body and red thorax. These small flies are closely related to mosquitoes and gnats. The males are about a quarter inch in length while females are one-third inch in length. There are two known species of love bugs in the United States. Originally, it was believed that love bugs were invasive, having come from outside of the United States, but that is not the case. It is also common folklore that these bugs are mistakenly created by humans. There are two key outbreaks in populations a year, once during April and May, and the next in August through September. They are often found near or by highways and are a nuisance and hindrance to drivers, and their body contents may damage car paint. However, there are some beneficial aspects to these species as it helps change its decay and vegetation into humus or fresh, new, nutritious soil. Adult love bugs like to seek pollen and nectar, therefore, they may be important in pollination. Female love bugs lay 100 to 350 eggs that are deposited underneath debris or decaying vegetation. After about 20 days, the larvae hatch and feed on the decaying plant vegetation. The larvae act as a decomposer in the natural habitat by converting the plant material into nutrients that can be used by growing plants. Once the larvae mature and have stopped feeding on the de decomposing vegetation, they pupate. In warmer climates such as Florida, the generation during the summer is significantly shorter than the winter generation because the rate at which the larvae pupate increases significantly with an increase in temperature. The pupal stage generally lasts about seven to nine days. Once adults, love bugs are ready to start copulating to begin pre-reproducing. Adult male love bugs emerge first from the pupal stage and hover around until female love bugs emerge. Mating between love bugs takes place immediately after emergence of the adult females. A male love bug copulates and will remain paired up until the female has been fully fertilized. The copulation takes place for two to three days before the female detaches, lays her eggs, and dies. Adult females have been recorded to live up to seven days, while adult males may live up to two to five days, but on average, love bugs live three to four days. Adult love bugs are non-threatening to humans because they do not bite or sting. They primarily feed on nectar from various plants, particularly sweet clover, goldenrod, and Brazilian pepper. Love bugs are a considerable nuisance to motorists. They congregate in unbelievable numbers along highways, and the insects spatter on the windshields and grills of moving vehicles. Windshields become covered with the fatty remains and vision is obstructed. Beekeepers complain because worker bees do not visit flowers that have been infested with the flies. A number of insecticides have been evaluated for effectiveness in controlling love bug larvae in adults. Most of them kill love bugs but are impractical because high populations of insects occur over vast areas of the state. A vacuum cleaner can be used to remove adults from confined areas such as in buildings or vehicles.